One in five kids has a significant mental health challenge, and yet four out of five of those never make it to care. If that were health care, and one in five kids had cancer, and four out of five never made it to the hospital, we wouldn't tolerate it. And yet, that's the case with mental health. So why? Um, a big reason for that is because of the stigma of mental health. When we think about mental health care and the limitations based on stigmas that exist today in society, we think about people getting access to mental health care, self-selected, self-proactive engagement with mental health care professionals is still very limited. We think about the fact that mental health care is typically kinetic. It's typically face-to-face -face interaction. That's very difficult, obviously through a pandemic with social distancing, it's expensive for clinical providers. And oftentimes um, it doesn't work necessarily in the benefit of the provider and the patient. So it's hard to scale. Uh, we also think about some of the stigmas that exist by different communities. When issues are brought forward to the surface, it generally pushes uh, some of the underlying challenges further down versus bringing them to light. Education around mental health is healthcare, okay? We need to bridge the gap between primary healthcare and mental health, such that uh, pediatricians and others who are on the front line uh, immediately recognize the need to connect that child with mental health care. Um, that is vital to that kid's overall health success. So we want to really challenge the system that doesn't support kids and families to get access to care through the financial means, through the, uh, the barriers of, of lack of integration of primary health care and health care, and also through the stigma and education that we need to provide that kids uh, can succeed, treatment does work, outcomes are available, but we have to be able to access that care. For over a hundred years, Canopy has created life-changing upstream solutions to ensure all children have a brighter tomorrow. Today, we are working with national thought leaders to prioritize and provide innovation to mental health issues. Canopy began uh, at around the turn of the century in 1912. For the last 110 years, as society has gotten more complex, uh, so have we. And we've continued to have the next iteration of what is the innovative solution that's going to address the vexing problem facing kids and families today. Canopy uh, has been the first to provide so many things. The first to do maternity homes in the state for pregnant teens. The first to do drug and alcohol uh, treatment centers for kids. The first to do psych residential treatment and to take that in the home in all 82 counties with telehealth. Uh, the first to, to kind of do this um, diversion program here to keep kids out of state custody. We've diverted over 4,000 kids from entering uh, child protection services since 2019. Uh, the first to do this autism center of excellence where we're taking early intervention and using the, the latest and greatest empirically supported treatments to have kids that are uh, with on the autism spectrum get back on track and to, uh, to live and to thrive and to go to school like every other kid uh, should be able to do. And so um, our, our, our vision today as we think about the needs of kids and families and the mental health challenges and the autism challenges is to continue to innovate around those vexing challenges, but also to bring in partners. Um, we realize that we can't do this work successfully without many like-minded, mission-minded, with a shared vision partnerships. One of the ways technology companies like Microsoft engage on an issue like mental health and how to use solutions to improve access to mental health care is to amplify organizations like Canopy. That, that use a wide range of solutions, both using technology solutions, face-to-face -face sort of traditional capabilities to interact primarily with children and the families that overcome so many different odds to try to give the best experience for their children. So we've been building digital solutions that make it possible for online engagement, to make the experiences of those with mental health challenges much more realistic to the day-to-day the -day challenges they have and making it possible for them to get help remotely, which is the single greatest issue we've had, particularly over the last 18 months, remote access to mental health care. You know, so one of 
the reasons I'm so passionate about the partnership between Microsoft and Canopy Children's Solutions is because it is the merger and intersection of two missions, two organizations that bring the best of their assets together and collaboratively try to make a social impact. So the mission of Microsoft is to empower every person and organization on the planet to achieve more. It's all about empowerment. I then go look at Canopy Children's Solutions that have a wide range of different offerings for children of every background so that they can thrive and bring their very, very best. So when we've come together over the last few years, we have found that we can build really cool online solutions that are easy, one-click access, that are not just for the student or for the young person, but for the parent and sometimes for the educator to know how to connect, how to identify when there's a mental health issue that's occurring or evolving. How do we alert, alert all of the stakeholders in the process? And then how do we address the individual who's going through crisis in the most empathic way possible? And the technology allows us to customize for the human, customize for their family, customize for their scenario. That's why I get so excited about this conversation because I think we've got a long way we can still go, but we've already seen the impact. And it's because of organizations like Canopy that I am absolutely encouraged that every child will be able to thrive in this United States and hopefully around the world. To join the conversation and transform the future of mental health for all, visit mycanopy.org.